Greetings, this is Paul the Pope from paulthepoke.com. Today's topic, trend update. Putin and Erdogan meet in Istanbul, uh, October 10, 2016. Uh, Russian President Vladimir Putin uh, met with Turkish President Recep Erdogan in uh, Istanbul, Turkey today. And the meeting was at the World Energy Congress. Now this is the third meeting between the two leaders since June of this year, 2016. Of course, being at the energy conference, Putin stated Russia is a reliable energy exporter to global markets. Now, the highlight of the meeting was the Turkish Stream gas pipeline. And this line will allow Russian natural gas delivered directly to Turkey by the Russian Black Sea coast. And then from Turkey, the natural gas would continue on to Greece. Now, natural gas capacity is expected to be approximately 32 billion cubic meters per year. Now, Turkey would receive approximately half of the natural gas, and Russia will be giving Turkey a discount on the natural gas. The rest of the natural gas will be distributed to Europe. Now also one of the discussion points was uh, the construction of the Akayu nuclear plant. And this nuclear power plant will have four 1,200 megawatt reactors. And a Russian company will build the facility. This is a $22 billion project. And the first phase of the project is expected to be operational by 2020. Now this is also Turkey's first nuclear plant. And along with that, normalization of fruit, vegetable, agricultural trade was announced by Putin. Now, this was cut off after uh, Turkey had shot down one of the Russian planes um, earlier this year, but that all seems to be forgiven. Now, the two countries are working toward free trade, and President Erdogan of Turkey hopes that trade levels will reach $100 billion per year. Now, differences do remain on the issue of Syria, uh, and this is a quote from Vladimir Putin. Both Russia and Turkey support the end of the bloodshed in Syria. We share the same view that every effort should be made for humanitarian aid to be delivered to Aleppo. The only issue is the safety of the delivery of the humanitarian aid. Now, meanwhile, you know, big picture, Turkey is a NATO member, but is becoming cozy, much more cozy, with Russia. And I've got links provided below from RT.com, which is a Russian news source, FoxNews.com, and the Wall Street Journal, which is WSJ.com. So links are provided below if you're interested in reading a little bit more of that. Uh, but the big picture, uh, you know, looking at this within the context of Ezekiel 38 and 39, and, uh, you know, it's a future reference to Russia and allies invading Israel, per Bible prophecy. And none of this would have been possible before 1948 until Israel became a nation. So the idea of, well, people will say, well, you know, every generation thinks this is the time that this is going to happen. Well, none of this was, was even possible until 1948, until Israel was a nation. And historically, the Ottoman Empire, or Turkey, and Russia, formerly of the Soviet Union, those two have been at odds. And just see the Russo-Turkish Wars, which began in 1568. And this is a series of wars that finally ended in the early 20th century. And then these two really haven't become friends of any sort until, you know, recently, in 2016, since the coup attempt of Turkey. Uh, but the bottom line, per scripture, the northern gang, that'd be Russia, Turkey, Iran, and Azerbaijan, they are together, and they are getting stronger politically, economically, and militarily, just as prophesied by Ezekiel roughly 2,700 years ago. See chapters 38 and 39. And at some point in the future, this group, along with a couple of African countries led by Russia, will invade Israel, per the prophet Ezekiel. And so people may question, well, how do you know that's Russia? How do you know that's Turkey? Got some links provided for that as well. Magog, 
uh, is modern day Russia. Uh, Meshach, Tubal, Beth the Garma, Gomer appear to be modern day Turkey. Again, links are provided. And do your own homework. Don't take my word for it. But if you're interested in this, please feel free to check out paulthepoke.com. Keyword Ezekiel 38, 39. Trend update. Erdogan, Putin, Russia, Turkey. All the family names. Magog, Meshach, Tubal, Beth the Garmer, and Gomer. Thanks for listening. You guys have a great day. Bye.